Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. Hope everyone is fine. On that note, let's start this video. So this is week 11 assignment of the course Ethical Hacking. So guys, uh, if you are new to our channel, please subscribe our channel. Definitely like the video and please share this with your friends as well. Friends and classmates. And please watch the video till the end guys. Don't skip the video. If you do so, you may miss some content. So do watch full video. Let's see the first question. Which of the following command is used to launch Metasploit framework? So for first question, the probable answer is option A guys. That is MS, MSF console. So friends, these are completely our probable solutions. So if there are any changes that come to our notice, definitely we will update that in the comment section guys. If you feel there should be any changes to be made according to you, then you can please give your opinion in the comment section positively so that we can try to sort it out. So mark option A as the probable solution for first question. Now moving on to the second one. In Metasploit, to check the compatible target OS for any exploit, which of the following command option is used? So for second question also, the probable solution is once again option A guys show targets so mark option a next moving on to the third question we can execute basic commands and tools inside metasploit console so for third question the answer is once again option a true So mark option A. Next, moving on to the fourth question now. Which of the following commands can be used to get an administrative privilege in Metasploit framework? For fourth question also, the probable answer is option A, get system. So mark option yeah guys, I have got only one option that is option A. Next, moving on to the fifth one. Which of the following modules is used to create new payloads? So for fifth question, the probable answer is option B guys, that is MSF Venom. MSF Venom. So mark option B guys. Next, moving on to the sixth question. So, before getting into the sixth question, I want to make a small announcement, guys. So, that is regarding exam preparation MCQs. So, for the course ethical hacking, we have collected the exam preparation MCQs, guys. These are past years NPTEL assignment questions. With five years of NPTEL experience, we have collected this. Here, you are going to get a huge number of 300 MCQs. 300 MCQs in a Google Drive PDF restricted link. So for one person it is 300 rupees guys. For two to five persons combinedly it is 500 rupees guys. So last time we have given for in the past we have given for 500 rupees even for one person also. But in order to reduce burden on students, for 300 MCQs we are giving for 300 rupees only for single person. Or else if your classmates or friends doing the same course, then please ask them to team up with you so that if you take it as combined two to five persons. For combinedly, you'll, you'll get the you'll, you'll get for the price 500 rupees, guys. Suppose five five members of your classmates are, if you take it combinedly, then you can five members can combine give a combined amount of 500. So individually, you can get it for less amount only. So anyone of your from your class take the lead and form groups to get this 300 MCQs pack, guys. So this is the mail id if you are confirmed to make the payment then only mail us because many genuine students are mailing us so we have to set everyone in the priority order only if you are confirmed to make the payment and make the purchase then only mail guys so this is the mail id pk179417 at the rate gmail.com if you are confirmed to make the purchase and payment then only mail us so this is the mail id guys i will give the same email id in the description box as well so these features of this pdf are search option is available so that you can search any question you want and it is easy to revise the validity will be till the exam results day guys so till then you'll get you'll have the validity and high syllabus will be covered in less time so you can easily revise that even going to the examination hall itself also so remember guys 300 mcqs 
will get for one person 300 rupees for two to five persons combinedly 500 rupees already many students professors associate professors assistant professors have also taken the pack so that's it guys so please share this news within your whatsapp college and official student groups so make some discussion happen on this positively so that you can get individually each one 300 mcqs per for one person it is 300 rupees guys for two to five persons combinedly 500 rupees so this is the mail id guys now let's get back to the solutions so sixth question which of the following tools use uses brute force uh, uses uh, which of the following tools uses brute force attack to extract existing and hidden pages of a web server for sixth question, the probable answer is option A, guys. That is DIRV. So mark option A once again. Next, seventh question. If a web page is vulnerable to blind SQL injection attack, then which of the following is true? So for seventh question, the probable answer is option B, guys. So mark option B as the probable solution for seventh question. Now let's move on to the eighth one. So th th this, this is the table they have given. They are asking which of the following SQL queries are malicious with respect to the above table. So for eighth question, I think none of option D, none of this is the probable solution, guys. So Mark, I'm going with option D. Next, ninth question. Which of the following SQL MAP options is used to list all users along with the hashed password? For ninth question, the probable answer is once again option A, users. Moving on to the final question of the assignment that is 10th one which of the following statement or statements is or are true for stored xxs so for 10th and final question the probable answer is there are two probable solutions that i have got the first one is option a guys and the other one is option b so mark a and b as the probable solutions for 10th and final question so friends these are the solutions for week 11 assignment of ethical hacking course so hope this video helpful for you if you feel the same please subscribe our channel like this video and definitely share this with your friends and classmates guys and don't forget to take this 300 mcqs google drive pdf restricted link pack so for one person 300 mcqs for one person 300 rupees for two to five persons if you take it as a group combine it will be 500 rupees so this is the mail id guys bk179417 at red gmail.com so that's it guys for this video so keep supporting us like this so until the next video goodbye thank you